Welcome back to the CTV News. Activities commemorating World Kidney Day will heighten this weekend with a major fundraiser. The annual observance aims to raise the awareness of the importance of kidneys to the overall health and to reduce the frequency and impact of kidney disease and its associated health problems. The Ministry of Health this year stepped up efforts at public awareness because increasingly, Senusians are being affected by end-stage kidney disease. There are nearly 100 patients on dialysis in the public health care system alone. The consultant nephrologist at the Victoria Hospital is Dr. Merle Clark. It is costing the government a lot of money to try to treat patients with late-stage kidney disease. Dialysis is extremely expensive. The medication is expensive. We are attempting to get a few transplants going overseas for now because even that is expensive. Treating late-stage kidney disease is expensive. So our efforts really are aimed at prevention, educating people so we prevent patients from developing kidney disease, particularly diabetics and hypertensive. I always emphasize the other people who are more predisposed than anybody else perhaps to developing late stage kidney disease. So we're hoping to capture these people, encourage them. Your blood sugars, your blood pressures need to be well controlled so you don't develop kidney disease. That really is our aim. And if we're able to achieve that, then I think that we could have been a success. And we will continue um, our educating. Hopefully we'll be able to get to everybody and make this initiative a success. The major activity for Kidney Awareness Week is a Celebrity Sports Day at the Bossy Jou Indoor Facility, which will be held on Sunday, March 15, from 10 a.m. All our celebrities are on board, all our politicians, our local musicians, our medical and dental association members, the bar association, our corporate citizens, everybody is on board, everybody is ready to go, revving and ready and been training, so Sunday is a place to be, Bossy Jou Indoor Facility from 10 a.m. The ministry invested in the development of a mascot to help bring the message of kidney health across to youngsters. Sydney the Kidney mascot was unveiled at the pediatric ward of Victoria Hospital earlier this week.